Hi everyone, this is Justin with the Drive Trust Alliance. The increasing popularity of solid state drives for Windows, laptops, desktops, and servers carries a hidden threat if the drive is a self-encrypting drive that has not been properly configured to prevent against ransomware attacks and denial of service attacks. If you're hit by one of these attacks, your only option is to revert the drive back to its factory state, which results in you losing all of your data, or optionally, to pay a ransom to an attacker to get your data back. This is a demonstration of how quickly this threat can be exploited. This is an old laptop I have that I put a self-encrypting drive into and installed Windows. The drive is currently in its factory state, so like all SEDs, the data on the drive is always encrypted, but since I've not set a password on the drive, it's vulnerable. So if an attacker can gain administrative access to your machine, whether that's local access or remote access, they can execute this attack in just a few seconds. On the desktop here is a script that does just that. So I will execute the script. And in just a few seconds, it's done. The final command of the script was to power the machine down. Uh, reason being, when the, when the drive loses power, it goes into its locked state. So all the data on the drive is encrypted, and without the password, the data is inaccessible. As you can see here, the system can no longer read the data on the drive, and therefore can no longer boot from the drive. This demonstration is a very simple denial of service attack. The only option for the end user at this point if they don't know the password would be to revert the drive back to its factory state which would cause them to lose all of their data. They can salvage the hardware, get their drive back, start over from scratch, but the data is gone. And one could see that this attack could easily be modified and turned into a ransomware attack. Now protecting your drive against these attacks is quite simple. The Drive Trust Alliance provides SED Protect which is based on our open source software and available free of charge. It's a lightweight software application that will detect if your self-encrypting drive has a vulnerable configuration. It will let you set up a control password that will immunize the drive against ransomware and denial of service attacks. Now, SED Protect does not lock your drive, but it prevents an attacker from locking it. So if you want to download it, head to drivetrust.com forward slash protect. Scroll down to the download section it's a single executable which you can download run the executable from the drop down list choose your drive it can be a system drive an external USB drive simply select it click on protect your drive and type in a password and that's it your drive is protected just that simple um, if you're curious whether or not the drive in your machine is a self-encrypting drive or not. SED Protect will tell you that as well. We'll plug in another drive here that I have uh, which is not a self-encrypting drive. Rerun the program, select my drive, and you can see down here in the status area it says not Opal, so it is not a self-encrypting drive. An Opal compliant self-encrypting drive. So that's all there is to it. If you want to download a copy of SED Protect, head out to drivetrust.com forward slash protect. You can read about the software. The downloads are available. Also check out our full functionality USB drive kit, which contains SED access. This software performs the same function as SED Protect, but additionally it will let you lock your USB drive to prevent others from accessing the data on it. And be sure to check out our main page too at drivetrust.com to learn all about the Drive Trust Alliance and self-encrypting drives.